Women who have an activated immune system because, for example, of autoimmunity, whether they have a defined autoimmune disease or this subclinical level of autoimmunity where they just have some abnormalities in their blood if tested, they often lose the ability to throw this switch. And therefore, the woman's immune system sees that implanting embryo still as foreign, as an organ transplant and would do the same thing that it would do to a real organ transplant, namely try to reject it. And therefore, that will affect uh, miscarriage rates. It will drive up miscarriage rates, and that's why women who have autoimmune problems are usually at an increased risk for miscarriages. But uh, it may also uh, affect the implantation process itself. And therefore, they may also have a harder time getting pregnant, either spontaneously or even when coming for infertility treatment. So it is very important that uh, these problems be recognized, uh, because the last thing we would want to, to, to happen in an infertility center is to help a patient to finally conceive and then God forbid she has a preventable miscarriage. So it is very important to pre-treat patients who have autoimmune problems in timely fashion before they even conceive.